So I'm using the Romance Angels Oracle deck. Let's see what you need to know regarding love. <laughs> Angels apparently have a lot to say right now. Trust, the situation is calling for you to have faith. All right, so two things. I'm getting one that if you are single, and you want to, you know, be in a relationship with someone or you're just wanting a relationship, trust that it's on its way and trust that the person you're pulling in for you, for you is trustworthy, is authentic, is genuine. All right. But I'm getting just trust, trust that the angels have your back and that love is around you or just at the very least on its way, like just trust. What else do you need to know? Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. It just said trust that it's on its way. Yep. I do not need to go into that. <laughs> I feel like that was self-explanatory and spirits like I said what I said. <laughs> Divine timing is always at play. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. For some of you, this will be a past person. And for some of you, that will be a welcome uh, reconnection, reconciliation. For others, this could just mean that someone from your past is coming back in. It does not mean that you need to be in a relationship with them again. Like if you literally have like gotten yourself to the point where you moved on, then you moved on. This, this would just be giving you a heads up that someone from your past is making its way back in. All right? Do with that what you will. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Um, so I do feel, you know, we're conditioned from a very young age to think, act, feel, behave in a certain way. Right? That happens with all of us as kids and growing up. And I do feel there is probably some beliefs and conditions regarding love, how you receive love, how you give love, whether or not you do in fact need to forgive your parents. Um, I do feel it's important for you to look at your beliefs and your conditions regarding love. Is that what's blocking you from receiving love or being able to give love in a healthy way? Like check in, go within right now and see how that could be playing a role in your love life. All right. I also feel though with this, and this isn't like not necessarily the meaning of the card, but I just feel intuitively this is also saying that if you're hoping to, you know, have a relationship and have a family of your own, be a parent to uh, children, that that's going to come into play for you. Like you will have that. All right. And that can also offer some healing for you as well. Let's pull one more here. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Possibly. Keep an open mind. Don't hold tightly to exactly how you want the person to look, to think, to, you know, do, whatever. Don't hold tightly to how you could meet someone. Don't hold tightly to when you'll meet someone. Just, just remain open and just go with the flow. Divine timing is always at play anyways. So that's what I got for you guys. If you're interested in booking a reading, please go to my website, naturalenchantmentsoracle.com. Have a great day.